legal authority uh, to access heaven. You're, in fact, the subtitle of your book is Earthly License for Heavenly Interference, and we'll get that explained <laughs> tomorrow. But I, I, I'm still, I'm still kind of stuck here on with someone that's watching that they're saying, well, so if, if I'm praying and nothing happens, does that mean I'm doing something wrong? I think the answer uh, would be for anything else. Uh, if I'm trying a, a key into a lock, keep trying and trying, and it's not opening, something is automatically wrong. Either the lock is wrong or the key is wrong. Uh, results are a result of correct principles. If you have the right key, you get the right results. So I suffered this way myself, as everyone perhaps have. I prayed for years and years and didn't get answers. As a pastor even, I prayed. Even as a young believer for years, I prayed. Didn't get answers until I understood that prayer is not automatic. This is important. Not because you talk, you can pray. Jesus said to the Pharisees, you think you will be heard because of your much speaking. He was actually telling them, these long drawn out dissertations that you give God, all quoting all these laws and, and all this you know, complicated language and, and these deep ritualistic words that you say in your re religious uh, addressing of God. He says, God's not hearing you. In other words, People say, well, it, prayer is just talking to God. That's not true. If that was true, we'd all be getting results. The, Jesus said, and this is important to remember, Luke chapter 11 is one of the most important verses you could read in the Bible. Because in that chapter, verse 1, it says, Jesus Christ was praying in a certain place at a certain time. And when he was finished, his disciples came to him and asked him, Master, Teach us to pray. It says, and Jesus said unto them, sit down. And he began for the next three chapters on a seminar on prayer. Mm -hmm. Now, here's my key here. They asked him, teach us to pray. He didn't say, teach you, just talk. You know, just say something. No, he says, let me teach you. And he taught them specific principles for three chapters. In other words, prayer has to be learned. Just that you got to learn the right key for the lock, you got to learn the right keys for accessing heaven and impacting earth. So the reason why you're probably not getting effective results for your prayer life is because you haven't learned how to pray. And we're going to talk about that in this series. I guarantee when we finish with this series, if you stay with me all week, whether you are a Hindu, a Buddhist, a Muslim, or atheist, or a Christian, whatever you are, just listen at least for the next you know, 10 sessions because you're going to learn that prayer is more than just talking, is more than just rituals. Prayer is supposed to get results every time. And I'm speaking from experience.